So, yeah, Abby here again. So, yeah, I know this is going to be, this is, you know, I want to say it's going to be a long road, but I was looking at Anthony's YouTube channel where he has a lot of food items, and I am, like, salivating. Some of it, it a lot of it looks so good. I, I'm like, oh my God, I, I'm so excited to eat some of those. The videos, they're on YouTube. They're, the channel name is Medical Medium. I mean, <laughs> this is the diet? Oh my God, it looks delicious. I, I'm just like, you know, why would anyone not eat this food? It's a really, 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 really good. Um, although, you know, I understand about the fruit. Sometimes you're like, okay, I've had a million grapes. I've had a million cherries. You know, thank God I've had a million blueberries. I am ready for a burger. <laughs> Let me have some, okay, I can't even think, pasta. But, um, yeah, I have to figure out the craving part. I was watching someone's video, YouTube video about cravings on the medical medium program and I think it was free something free yourself I can't remember what her, her YouTube channel is but if you're looking at medical medium stuff and you go onto YouTube and you'll you'll find her it's something free yourself something I don't know there's a lot of really you know I there's not I, I, I've seen a couple youtubers um, that are doing medical medium program that they're just really nice people they just seem really nice and I, I it's so enjoy enjoyable to watch them but yeah it's like my daughter was asking me how long am I gonna have to do this mom like I'm, I'm you know and what are the foods I'm like okay Rachel I haven't you know I haven't gone through the book you know basically it's you know lemon it's lemon water celery juice and then you go on to a detox smoothie and um, then I'm not sure what's next. I think there's more liquids if possible. So I have to kind of figure out exactly to get the book. I have to look at the 28 day program and write it down and yeah. So um, I don't know. I, I know there's like a spinach soup in there and I'm really excited to try it because I don't know, just people are saying it's really good. So, um, celery juice takes a while to get used to, but you know, you, when you have the celery juice, you're not thinking, oh, is this going to be yummy? Because it's not, it's not yummy, but you know, because it's medicinal. So you're saying to yourself, this is going to be very helpful for my body. I'm going to drink this even if it doesn't taste that great, even if it's uh, not easy to do it's okay I'm getting far more benefit I can deal with a little eh, you know um, but as you go along it kind of has a milky taste to it it's kind of an odd thing I have these uh, little sorry um, emails that keep on flashing up so um, but I was thinking it would be kind of neat for me to you know be in front of you and try the smoothie and kind of describe the detox smoothie what it tastes like after you put in like cilantro and and uh, what is it you know Hawaiian spirulina and uh, what's the barley grass powder barley grass powder I think that's what it is and you put the wild blueberries and you put in I think you put banana I can't remember it all I can't remember it all and just have a taste test of the different items and then like have it so everyone can so everyone knows what someone else thinks but I'll tell you this you, you kind of have to be open to all this and if you're not really open then I would suggest someone would you know I just started this and I'm suggesting things great Abby oh that's great but I'm still suggesting I would suggest someone go take it on slowly because something happens when the vegetables and fruits get in there. It's happening to me. Um, something does happen. Now, I have a long story, and I said I was going to talk about all my diets and everything, but there is a period of time that I did a raw food diet. It was not a plant-based diet. It was more, it was based, It no, it was, it was a plant-based. It was a, I did a vegan diet. I didn't even know it was vegan. It was a raw food diet. I was watching 
a couple different people like David Wolf and Gabriel Cousins. He does a live living foods. And I was some of the older, um, even people that are older than they are, they're not that old, but um, that were really into raw food. Um, I can't remember their names now. Um, but so it wasn't a fruit based raw food thing. It was like lots of greens. It was some fermented foods. It was lots of sprouts. Um, it was, you could still, you, you, I, I still had smoothies. I would start the day with, I actually would start the day with lemon water and then I would add to like a green smoothie that basically had bananas, maybe strawberries if I had it and like some kind of green. And so I had have green smoothies and just water, water is my base. So I was actually surprised when I started seeing everyone use almond milk and soy milk and all these different milks um, in their smoothies because, you know, you almost get better results using water, but I'm thinking you get even better results if now if you use like coconut water. Okay, I'm going to end this because there's someone pulling up next to me and I do not want to be doing this. I'm sorry, everyone. I'll get back. I'll, I'll do more videos. Goodbye.